Uh, how's everyone doing? Awesome. Did everyone have fun here? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So I made an app called, well, you'll see. Oh. All right, so it's called Switcher. It's basically uh, rapid task switching on Android. So you can switch between tasks really quickly. Um, and it was inspired partly by Windows 8. And I'll explain. So watch the animation that just plays. Swap it from the left, and you get access to an app that was running in the background. And so, yeah, swap it from the left on Windows 8, lets the user switch to a previously run task. Pretty simple. And now, Switcher brings that to Android. So that same animation is kind of, yeah, it's like that. How it works. So just as on Windows 8, Switcher is initiated with a swipe from the left edge of the screen. And swap detection works flawlessly regardless of the current foreground application. So you could be on any app and you could just swipe from the left and you have access to the switches. Okay. So gestures, if you drag the card kind of thing all the way to the right, it kills the app. Pretty simple. Okay. And then a video demo. Yeah, cool cat sessions, right? Okay. Switcher was inspired from a feature of Windows 8. When I slide my finger in from the left edge of the screen, I can go back to a previously running app. Using Switcher on Android, I can use the left edge of the screen and swipe in to see all the running apps in the background. I've got eBay, GitHub, and Instagram. Let's go to eBay. Okay, from eBay we can still access that left edge no matter the orientation. We can go to GitHub, and we can also access that list. We can switch back and forth by doing this gesture. If I want to kill an app, I simply swipe to the right. If I want to go home, I can do this. Let's kill the eBay app. Let's kill all the apps. When there are no apps running, the only option you get is to go home. Let's open up Chrome and demonstrate. Chrome is the only app running right now. And the only option you'll get is home when you swipe in from the left because no other apps are in the background. Let's open eBay. Let's go back to Chrome. Since eBay is the only other app running in the background, we'll get the eBay option. We can either kill it by going right or we can let go and switch to the eBay app. You can also kill Chrome, and now the only app running is eBay, and the only option you get is to go home. And that's the basic principles of Switcher. Thanks. Okay, so the release date is not actually today. Um, I know last code day I did release the app, but this, this time it's going to be early July, because I'm taking part in uh, Student Army Labs, which is a really cool program where you do stuff over the summer. Just build cool stuff, and so this was one of the ideas I had for Student Army Labs. And so I got an early start here, and it's going to be releasing early July um, with, the, with the start of Student Army Labs. And so we're probably going to throw a launch party on every app we release, so you guys should come to Student Army on whenever we release it, and uh, yeah, free food on us and all that. Uh, all right, so... Um, it really is. Question. It's a really cool way to add a, um, an interaction to your Android device. So um, the useful award goes to Switcher, which was not only done uh, in a way that was useful, but also super professional, really impressed by the presentation, the graphics, um, and it's no wonder that you have uh, successful Android apps up there in the, in the Play Store. So. Switcher.